The humble spade, probably one of the most used tools in the garden. But if you call a spade a spade, what do you call a shovel? A shovel, not a spade. Traditionally, these are all referred to as spades, but there's a vast difference. Let's have a closer look at their differences and their usages. A spade has an almost flat surface with straight sides and a front. They're mainly used for digging holes, trenches, and edging gardens, basically anything where you need a straight line. Spades can also be used to remove weeds from paving, but I don't recommend that as it could damage your paving but more importantly, the roots remain and the weeds will grow back. Shovels, however, are bowl shaped and are far superior when you need to move quantities of soil, sand, stone, and even concrete mix. Because of their shape, they are able to hold a greater volume compared to a spade, where a lot of the sand will fall off the side. As you can see here, one load of sand with the spade is far less quantity than one load from the shovel. Shovels generally have a pointed end, which is great for digging soil from a garden heap or a garden bed. That said, some shovels have a straight end, and these are really useful when you're scooping up off a flat surface. Let's look at spades a little closer. Here we have two almost identical spades. The main difference is the size of the actual working surface, one being wider and longer than the other. This means I can dig a larger hole quicker whereas this spade is ideal for small holes, for example, if I'm planting new plants. These both have plastic handles and they're fairly lightweight, ideal for use around the home. The spade is made from a single piece of steel, meaning it is stronger, but also heavier, and is more suited to someone who spends a lot of time in the garden, or for a garden service business, or even a builder. Shovels come in a wide variety of sizes and materials, ranging from these small hand shovels that are a must for any gardener up to the larger models. A lot of these small shovels have a depth measurement on the blade. The measurements on the small spades are ideal for planting bulbs as they have specific needs when it comes to planting depth. The plastic range, light and strong, and best of all, they have some funky colors. This transplanting shovel has deeply curved sides, which makes transplanting a simple job. And these two wooden shaft shovels are brilliant if you're working in the flower beds on your knees. However, my favorite use for this, get the kids outside, let them help you. They're incredibly lightweight. They have a steel blade and a comfortable plastic grip. They're also useful to pop into the boot of your car if you're heading away for the weekend, maybe a camping trip, and are great for moving hot coals from the fireplace into the brine. So that's my one-on-one -on, -one on spades and shovels. And now that you know the main differences, Builders has a spade or shovel for you, in store or online at builders.co.za. For more videos like this, check out the blog on the website. Get to Builders, get it done.